Look, the crystals can sense each other. You have one too, don't you? My mission is to kill Chaos. That's all I know. Me too. Good. We're all in the same hunt. I'm Jack. Jed. Ash. What? Need something for that? Hmm. <laughs> it's just a scratch. Nothing a little spit can't heal. When are we gonna fight Chaos? All this monster hunting is a pain in the ass. Seriously. Fingers crossed we're done. Either way, time to pay the king a visit. And we don't leave without answers. Hmm. Hmm. The world lies shrouded in darkness. The winds die. The seas languish. The earth decays. But the people believe in a prophecy, patiently awaiting its fulfillment. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. <laughs> you are skilled, to be sure. Few could have slain even one of those abominations, let alone three. There is still the matter of your number, however. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. And your crystals trouble me. They do not shine the color they should. Can't argue with that. But you need warriors, right? <laughs> Look in front of you. Here we are, ready and willing to take Chaos down for you. And with all due respect, isn't that what matters most? Perhaps. Yet a question still weighs on my mind, warriors of the Dark Crystals. Why court danger so eagerly? What could you possibly hope to gain? All I care about is seeing Chaos dead. I need to. It's not a hope or a dream. It's like a hunger. A thirst. Hmm. Does that answer your question? Very well. Minister Lagom, fetch the key to the shrine. <sighs> My lord. Jack, Ash, Jed. I place the future of Cornelia in your hands. Do not fail us. I'll deliver the key to you in the morning. Make your preparations, and wait for me at the city gates. Until then. Hmm? What's going on? Princess Sarah. The people love her. <sighs> like a flower blooming in a dark wasteland. <laughs> Come on, Jack. Wouldn't kill you to smile for once. <sighs> Jack, you've returned. <sighs> and with a few more scars. Nah, it's nothing. Jack has the best medicine. Oh, that's wonderful. 
In that case, if it's not too much trouble, would you be able to spare some for our soldiers in the castle? <laughs> <laughs> There's no medicine, is there? Is there something you want? There is. I need a favor from you. I heard you were going to the shrine, so I thought this would be my only chance to ask. A favor? Two, actually. Of course. There was a knight by the name of Garland who set off to battle Chaos as well, but he never returned. If you could, I would be grateful if you looked for him. Look, we don't have time for a rescue mission, princess. I understand. You don't need to go out of your way. Just keep an eye out for him. What does he look like? He always wore such splendid armor, with a helmet that was terrifying to behold. He towered over the other knights, even so, his voice was always warm. How long ago was this? Perhaps ten years ago. Although... It seems just like yesterday. No one believes me. Not the minister, not my father. They say a knight by the name of Garland never existed. As you wish. We'll see what we can do about your missing knight. <sighs> Thank you, Jack. <sighs> Jack, wait. The other favor. Come back safe. And soon. <clears throat> May the crystal's blessing be with you. Always. Odd. Your crystal vibrating too? Yeah. Weird. Forget it. We need to focus. Tomorrow's gonna be a long day. Let's get some rest. Hey, Jack. Just the guy I wanted to see. I heard you're off to the shrine tomorrow. Why don't you spend the night here? Yeah. Great. Come on in. News of your departure will soon spread, and failure will leave a stain on the king's reputation. Bear this in mind. Travel northwest, and you will reach the Chaos Shrine. Go with the Crystal's blessing. Looks like Chaos has been waiting for us. You gonna make us go in there and find you? Guess we'll just show ourselves in. Chaos. No. I am to become him. And who are you? We're here to kill Chaos. The prophecy's very own warriors of light. Really? He always wore such splendid armor with a helmet that was terrifying to behold. It's Garland! No! I am to become Chaos! <clears throat> T 
Time for the reveal. Wait. My crystal. It's her. Yeah, just like before. Huh. Mine's going crazy. I'm Neon. And not Chaos. Guess I was right. Huh. Feels like there's a story behind that. My allies and I set out to rid the land of Chaos. But the journey took its toll. One by one we fell. Until only I remained. It was then that I finally realized the truth. Chaos isn't a man. Or a monster. Mm -hmm. Chaos... ...is just a fairy tale. The darkness, the beasts... ...this despair that eats away at people's hearts... ...it's easy to blame a single thing for all of that. It gives people hope to think the world can be saved with a single heroic deed. Even if it's never that simple. So I decided to become a sacrifice. I offered myself to the darkness, and prayed to become Chaos... ...hoping some band of heroes would defeat me... ...and thus bring an end to this empty dream. Bullshit. He's out there. I can feel him. I just have to keep looking. I'll find him. I'm coming too. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. And I only count three of you. We don't need someone whose heart's not in it. Then show me chaos. Do that, and I might even start to respect you. Deal. We better get back to the castle. Wouldn't want to disappoint our patrons. Seen it react like this. Here we are. <sighs> I couldn't. <sighs> You chaos. I am its servant. One of four. Its servant? We are the thieves of chaos. Masters of the crystals. 
Their power courses through our veins. You shall not have them! Doesn't matter how many of you there are. I'll kill every last one. Will you? Then come and meet your fate! Your foolish journey ends here! I know its name. Tiamat. Hey, one? Looks like it. Did you defeat Tiamat? Yeah. Well done. And you are? We came here to challenge the darkness, but it seems we were no match for it. I'm Sophia. Well met. <laughs> and now the wind crystal shall be made whole. <laughs> Your crystal, hold it forth! <laughs> was that? I can't explain. I only know that the crystals can consume the mist. <laughs> Is this one gonna start talking too? Maybe we should ask her. How do you use this thing again? I have a good memory. Discipline, you understand. Though fragmented, I do retain some knowledge of my past. And I am sure I have been here before. Many times. And many times, this has been my grave. I want nothing more than to destroy chaos. Until I do, there is a yearning inside me that cannot be sated. In other words, may I accompany you? I see no reason to refuse. Don't die on me. I'll forget without you. That goes for you too. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. What do we got here? <sighs> Jack, your crystal.
Your memories will be stored in this device. Be sure to bring it back. Hurry, Jack! <sighs> you okay, Jack? You were checked out for a bit. The smell got to my head. So that mist comes from the darkness. That's right. Its power is frightening. It drives man and beast alike to madness. There you are. You really should be careful of that mist. It could drag you into the past. Or worse, turn you into a monster. Really? You don't say. Was a heads up too much to ask for? And deny myself the joy of a kindred spirit? So you're a monster? In a manner of speaking, I suppose you could say I am. Have you ever seen things in Cornelia that just don't seem to belong? Things like this tower? Lufenia leaves its detritus in our world. Who? Lufenia. A mysterious nation that created our world with their advanced technology, then vanished. Just vanished? Yes. Although if by choice, I cannot say. Now then, I believe you have some crystals to revive. I know you don't want to hear this. Then don't say it. No can do. This one's not like the rest. Don't let your guard down. Pleased to meet you. It looks like we're together again. I'm so excited. I'm honored. It's a privilege to work with you. Let's do this. It's nice to meet you. My dreams come true. A pleasure to meet you. It's an honor. I'm counting on you. I'm glad. Get away from me! <sighs> Thank you, Jack. I owe you one. Oh, don't worry about it. Let's keep moving.
Jack, it's up to you now. Ash? Jack, snap out of it! Oh. Don't let the darkness win! <clears throat> so I take it you're the one who stole the Earth Crystal's shine. The crystal's gentle waves resonate through the verdant land, enriching the soil and nurturing the trees. Harvests are bountiful, and from sun to sea, people sing the praises of the earth. A foolish dream, no matter how much you wish it, that season will never come. It will remain a dream, so long as I live. I am... I don't give a fuck who you are! <clears throat> I am Lich, and I shall devour all that is good! Who's this guy? Not a clue. Gotcha! You're not off the hook just yet. <laughs> like I'd trust you guys to finish the job. Ash, we'll lift it up so you pull him out. You got it. One, two, three! <laughs> <laughs> We did it! So you saw the past. Satisfied now? Not really. I can't even remember the friends that died under my watch. You would never let that happen, Ash. <laughs> Greetings, O oh most illustrious warriors of light. You've restored three crystals, wind, fire, and earth. That means you've defeated three fiends as well. The wind blows, the flames burn hot, and the soil is fragrant and fertile. You've done such a splendid job. Now, this isn't exactly a standing ovation, but it'll have to do. What do you want? Jack, 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 always so straight to the point. It spoils the fun, but very well. The pirates of Pravaka put out that you saved the water crystal for last. The winds blow strong, and the seas are too rough for their liking. The good Captain Bicke and the other old salt think you and the Cornelian King are in cahoots to ruin them. Now my problem. I thought you'd say that. Of course, if you went and said that to Bicke's face, you'd get an anchor to the jaw. But really, don't worry about it. Leave them to me. Why? What are you planning? I'll buy time by spinning them a long-winded elven tale. Pirates love a good yarn, but please do hurry. All that's left is the water crystal. Yeah, and the final fiend. <sighs> um... <sighs> hey. Y you might not like this, but... You know I like to speak my mind. Let's go. <sighs> the monsters are bad news, but the mist is even worse. Touch it. 
and someone else's memories become yours. If you want to stay who you are, don't let it come near you. Nice work. The mist's coming. <laughs> Jed, let go of me. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, I'm so happy. As long as you're around, I'm sure it'll be fine. Just tell me what you need me to do. Oh, right. Sorry. Stop. Shut up. But if I become a warrior of light, why would I come back? I'm nobody around here anyway. Pretty bold for a nobody. <laughs> yeah. You're free to go home later, but for now I need you here. Right. <clears throat> I've been waiting for this. Same. <laughs> I have something to confess. Just like Jed did. You see... I'm not like you guys. I was born here, in Cornelia. <clears throat> For the longest time, I couldn't remember how I got this. But now I do. The one who gave it to me... was Astos. I remember meeting him there, in the Chaos Shrine. He gave me the crystal, and told me I'd be needing it. I took it from him, and yielded to the darkness. The next thing I knew, you guys were there. That sure beats my confession. I felt like... I had been waiting for that moment for a long time. But I don't remember much anymore. All I know now is that... I want to see this through to the end. And... I want it just as badly as you guys do. I won't give up. I know we can do this together. Try anything weird and you're out. Right. through your friends first. Give us back the crystal. You demand to have the crystal back. And a farewell for so long without it. What would you do with it if turned to you? What would we do? You have come all this way. Yet know not of its brilliance. Uh, uh, mm. Neon, say something. You would bring mayhem to the world. I don't have time to listen to your nonsense. You dare brandish your blade at the Kraken. You forget your place. As such, you should touch it as much as possible. 
Your personal memories will be stored in that device, too. There is much to be gained from memories of your experiences. If you fail to do so, you run the risk of forgetting when you transfer. I don't care. It's not worth remembering. Don't say that. You are nothing if not the sum of your memories. <sighs> It's done. It's over, right? Right. The currents are moving, so that means the sea's back to normal. So now what? Beats me. Should be clear sailing ahead. We tore the roots of evil out of this world, after all. Something wrong? It's still there. A feeling that chaos is waiting somewhere. It hasn't left me. Well, why don't we go back to the castle? We could tell them about the fiends we fought and the crystals we revived, which makes us... Warriors of Light? Yeah, Warriors of Light, like in the prophecy. Something bad is stirring, and it's not just the storm. We've risked our lives to restore light to the crystals. They shine more brightly than ever before. Is this not what you wanted? Yet we return to sneers and snickers. If you have something to say, then say it now! Lucan's prophecy says four warriors of light will come! Four! One of you is an imposter! Excuse me? We never trusted you! It's all your trust. fault! Says who? You? You? Or maybe you? The darkness looms around us, closer than ever. What did you do? So much for a hero's welcome. Let's head to the castle. We should get a warmer reception there. have you done? Some reception. <laughs> exactly what you told us to do. We found the lost crystals and restored their light. And yet flames leap wild from our hearths. Fierce gusts of wind rattle our windows. The waves lash at our shores, and the land shifts and groans under our very feet. I'm sure it's just the crystals doing their thing. Might take some time to get used to it. But I bet this is what this world is supposed to be like. Oh, they speak of you as demons in the town below. They call you dark servants of chaos! Minister, uh. you go too far. <sighs> yes, that was rude. The history of Cornelia is tightly bound to chaos. Who can remember a world without its dark presence lurking in the shadows beside us? Yes, the crystal's light has been restored, 
but we cannot expect the prosperity of our lost Golden Age to reappear overnight, as if by magic. Sarah. Change is never easy. Until peace returns, is it not our responsibility to be the light of hope for the people? To give them a beacon to look to for comfort? <sighs> Your Majesty, terrible news! The pirates of Pravica are running amok in the city! What?! That rattle is no match for our soldiers! Capture them at once! No! Slaughter them! <sighs> Monsters have invaded the city, Your Majesty. It's chaos in the streets. Chaos? Curses! Seal the gates! Defenders to the walls! Protect the castle! Malloy! <laughs> what now? <laughs> Fighting's what I live for. Or have you forgotten? to have you fighting by our side. We'll remain here to protect the royal family. <laughs> Jack! human left in them, eh? Hmm. The sea... She's changed. We lost our home. A way of life. All us old sea dogs were scared. Confused. Angry. And that's when the darkness took hold. It happened in the blink of an eye. I, I couldn't do anything for them. Captain... I'm just a deckhand past his prime. Let's get you some help. No, lad. I've set sail for the last time. So you came here just to die? No. I came here to find you. Mm hmm? I went looking for Arstos, figuring he could put a stop to all this, but that sneaky scoundrel was nowhere to be found. Find him for their sakes. Astos. If my guess is right, he's been sparring with chaos longer than either of us can reckon. You told us he made a deal with chaos. Which is it? I can't well say for sure, lad. His heart is filled with hatred, and clouded with an unspeakable darkness. He hides it well. But when I catch a glimpse of it, I shudder. It's a cousin of chaos, if not the thing itself. I thought I was good at reading people, but... Elves, that's another matter. Whether servant of darkness or light, his secrets are beyond me. You're going to have to figure it out for yourselves. Tell us where to go. Tell us where we can find Astos. Follow the bats. They're his creatures. Got it. This may sound odd coming from an old Corsair like me, but 
Don't give in to hatred. Don't let it control you. Or you'll end up like old Dickie. I don't even know who to hate anymore. How did it all end up like this? I've never made it this far before. In all my fragmented memories, nothing resembles this. What happens now? We dive headfirst into the unknown. All right, let's get a move on. Follow the bats, and we'll find Astos. Seems so. Play with us. <clears throat> Your memories will be stored in this device. Be sure to bring it back. Understood. Be aware that storage space is limited. When that limit is exceeded, you must cease your activities and await extraction. From where? It varies. Just contact Astos when you're ready for pickup. I think he's all right. from this isn't like you are you sure you want to know we're strangers that means two things one we're strangers to this world and two we're strangers to ourselves not remembering who we are that's what lets us fight without fear or hesitation it's a mercy to forget those were your words Jack It doesn't matter. In the end, there are no answers here. I don't remember either. Neither do I. <sighs> yeah, same. You know I don't. <clears throat> Perhaps Astos can shed light on our questions. Seeing you again truly does bring a smile to my face. Oh, thanks for saving me. I'm in your debt. What were you doing here? My eternal duty, as it were. Monitoring the darkness. Keeping track of it. Details. And fast. Or I'll get mad. Fine, fine. But first, I need a little... favor. Step outside, and you'll see a strange castle that seemingly appeared out of thin air. A fresh new look for the neighborhood. The place is rife with monsters born from chaos. Give them the old one too, then we'll talk. Oh, and if you see any other new edifices pop up, give them the same treatment, would you? Ideally before they spread darkness and death across the land. Using us for your own ends? Heavens, no. You forget this is simply what you wanted from me. Now. I have work to do, so 
if you'll excuse me. <sighs> Toodles. <sighs> Forget him. We're leaving. That way? Lufenia left this behind. Looks new. Maybe this is a gift. A tower filled with monsters? <laughs> they have an odd sense of humor. Yeah, and some amazing tech to throw around. This is our fault. This must be our reward for purifying the crystals. What is it? That feeling's gone. My drive. My purpose. It's not there anymore. thing's name. <laughs> How many times have I been here? We finally partitioned ourselves off from that vile, obsolete world. We cannot allow them to re-establish the connection from their end. That is why we need to keep monitoring the balance of light and darkness. If it looks like it will crumble, then we inject darkness to reverse the course, or reset the world, if need be. Lufenia is a glittering jewel, a utopia. Uncontrollable variables have no place here. Are the visions I'm seeing from this... Lufenia? Is that... where I come from? <laughs> I'm just another one of their gifts. And you... They just left you behind, didn't they? Wait! The Lufenians sent me here. Why? What are they trying to accomplish? And where, where did this desperate urge to eradicate chaos come from? Jack, if this is what we think it is, if this really came from our homeland, from Lufenia, then they must already know what's going on here. Astos, he's not just monitoring and recording the status of the darkness. He's reporting back to his superiors. Let's kill these monsters and pry some answers out of him. You're late. But no matter. Relax. We won't have any more gifts to deal with. Light and darkness are in perfect balance. Thanks to your noble efforts. So, where would you like me to start? First, tell us who you are. Guess. I'm not in the mood for games. Guess. <sighs> A Lufenian? No. Not one of them. 
They, on the other hand, are former Lufinians. They're working with me, but for their own ends. To be honest, they'd be just as happy to see me dead. I was the one who turned them into bats, after all. My enchantment will fade if you kill me. And I'm sure that's why they've been so very helpful to you. They're hoping you'll decide to slit my throat for all the trouble I've caused you. Isn't that right? I'm sorry I asked. To be honest, I don't give a damn about you or these bats. It doesn't matter who or what you are. I only want one thing from you, Astos. I want you to give me a reason to live. An enemy to fight. Can you do that? I'd love to, Jack. Really, I would. But I can't. I've lived too long, you see. An eternity of regret. My heart's full of enough sadness, resentment, hatred, and rage to fill an ocean. I might as well be a dark crystal myself. Jack, I ask you one more time. Who am I? Uh, the King of the Dark Elves. That's all? Yeah. I despise the Lofenians. I hate them so much I could scream. I was born in Cornelia. I traveled with the Lofenians across the plains. I was reborn. I came back. And now... I don't know where my heart should lie. Your memories will be stored in this device. Be sure to bring it back. Understood. Be aware that storage space is limited. When that limit is exceeded, you must cease your activities and await extraction. From where? It varies. Just contact Astos when you're ready for pickup. Astos? Our newest organic reconnaissance unit. We'll show it to you later. I don't see much point. I'll forget about it either way. But Astos won't forget you. By the way, I know I must have asked this a dozen times before, but... Why do we have to forget? Simple. To ensure our glorious future. Organic Reconnaissance Unit Astos at your service. Thanks to the benevolence and technology of your people, a simple Cornelian elf like me was reborn to aid your glorious cause. Please don't think of me as a friend or comrade. 
My kind are mere bioorganisms, mass-produced to serve. Truly, I say this out of concern for your well-being. In the past, strangers died for us, sacrificing themselves out of a misguided sense of justice. <laughs> Pretty stupid of them. It's just a scratch. Nothing a little spit can't heal. <laughs> sure thing. I'll keep that in mind. I thought I made it clear. Me and my kin are disposable pawns, grown in droves to die for you. <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm just glad you're okay. <clears throat> <clears throat> Pretty stupid of you. <laughs> Not gonna argue with you on that. Astos, I want you to be my accomplice. With your help, we may be able to change things next time. What would you have me do? Next time we meet, guide us. Show us the way. I don't care how you do it. They're supposed to change the extraction point every time, you know. But just between us, it's almost always the Chaos Shrine. <sighs> Careless of them. When rules become mere formalities, well, that's when things start breaking. The preparations are complete. Good luck, and be careful. Hey, Astos. Wanna come with us? Huh? Don't you want to go home? It's not a matter of what I want. It's uh, against the rules. Then I'll change them. I'll fight for you. You'll just forget. I won't. Don't get my hopes up. I promise you, I won't forget. Next time. I will bring you back. Goodbye, Jack. See, you forgot. Astos. I don't blame you. They're the ones erasing your memories. It's not your fault. I know all that, and yet... I still hated you for it. I resented you for forgetting... Forgetting me. Forgive me. I wish I could forgive you. But it's too late. There's no room left in my heart for that. <coughs> we need to talk about what comes next. The enchantment. On those Lufinians will be undone the moment I draw my final breath. But as the magic fades, so too will their lives. We'll go to the grave together. Honestly, I'm amazed at how much hatred they can bear. Our darkness will merge into a veil that will shroud the entire world. Jack, fight the beasts that emerge from our shadows. Destroy them all. Every last one. Hmm. 
Chaos finds its genesis when darkness and emotion become one. Wherever it rears its head, be there to cut it off. From there, all I can ask is that you follow your conscience. Though it may lead you into the heart of darkness itself, never stop. Never. This is... the last gift I can give you. Use it well. <laughs> Punish the Lufenians for their arrogance. Protect Cornelia. You forget. We're Lufenians too. That doesn't matter. Not anymore. From this day forward, you are the warriors of light. Jack, we can't stay here. Let's go. <clears throat> Source of all Cornelia's woes are those damn Lufinians. But we don't even know where to find them. It's a mercy to forget. <laughs> don't make me laugh. They fed us fancy logic and false rationales. But it was all bullshit. They erased our memories to keep us from the truth. What's our next move? We make Astos's dream come true. We free Cornelia from the Lufenians' meddling. Come on. This is horrible. Do you think the castle held out? We made a promise to Astos. Let's go! Were we too late? Where's Sarah? Not here, at any rate. Everyone, you're okay. The king, queen, and minister have gone outside to try and restore order. Have you seen them? Are they okay? Nope. Sorry to disappoint. <laughs> Jack! Is there any way I can help? The city is choked with terror and fear. When that mixes with darkness, chaos takes hold. In other words, Princess, your city is the most dangerous place in the world right now. Are you telling me to flee my city? My people? To run away? I cannot do that. It is my duty to share the fate of my subjects. Stay here and you'll be at the mercy of the darkness. We can't let that happen. If that is my fate, then so be it. Hmm. <clears throat> Sarah! Wake her once you're outside. She'll see sense when there's no choice but to run. Got it. You lot keep the princesses safe. I'll carve us a path out of here. Keep up! Bye. 
survived the crystals. This is all your fault. Damn right it is. Warriors of light. Don't make me laugh. You're nothing but servants of chaos. So what are you going to do about it? Want to die here? Go and die. If you want to live, follow us. Now you want our help? I never doubted you. Not for an instant. <sighs> it's dangerous here. Link up with the others behind me. Thank you. Thank you. I've never been struck by anyone before. I had no other choice. <laughs> Watching you risk your lives to save us made me realize something. I was wrong before. Mia and I must survive. We must become beacons of hope among the chaos that all may look to in times of doubt. As royalty, as leaders, that is our truest duty. I realize that now. Hmm. My sister is right. We'll be the light of hope for you all. They're right. Yeah. Yes. My people, there is no need to despair. We shall face these hardships as one. And as one, we shall overcome them. There's always hope. Right. Right. I'm taking a walk. We're yes, with you. Our Highness we can will do save this. us. With us. Doesn't seem like much has changed out here. So where to? I was thinking Pravika might be good. Plenty of space, no people. Smart. Neon. Go get the others. Think Sarah and her people can make it that far? Jack! Get over here now! I love this song. You can borrow it if you want. No, it's okay. I memorized it. I think it'd be wonderful if I could adapt this song to the lute. Will you come hear it once I've finished? I'm a stranger here, likely to wander off before long. And when I do, you'll forget me. I'll never forget you. You sure about that? Of course I am. You never forget your first love. Oh. Oh. I never asked your name. It's Jack. <laughs> Stop. I meant your last name. Oh. Garland. My name's Jack Garland. That's... a lovely name. Be safe, Jack. May the Crystal's blessing be with you, always.
Sarah, I... I'd like you to have this. But... This is very special to you. You've never even let me touch it before. A friend gave me some advice once. He said, you've got to be crazy if you want to change the world. As the world changed for the better, Jack. All I see are more scars. You see now, right? The Lufenians rip holes in reality, dispatching strangers like you as regulators. If the balance of light and darkness fails, they won't hesitate to reset the world. They couldn't give a damn about Cornelia or its people. What are you talking about? I'm guiding you like you asked me to. They can't control chaos. That's their weakness and our opportunity. This is the third time we're having this conversation. This was all your idea. Memory is the cornerstone of emotions. Allow them to overwhelm you, and it won't be long until they warp you into something unspeakable. Become corrupted by chaos, and you will no longer be permitted to return. Veterans are precious resources. Do not slip up. Though darkness is a controlled substance crafted and introduced with great care, when it bonds with powerful negative emotions, it forms chaos. By manipulating your memories, we can repress your emotions to some degree. But if chaos takes root, you are lost to us. It's now or never. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> the rest is up to Jack. <sighs> Time for the finishing touch. It's a shame what happened to the royal family. Still, I had fun this time. <laughs> Jack! Give in to your emotions. Let the darkness take hold. The only thing Lufinia fears is something it can't control. Chaos. Are you crazy? is to kill chaos that's all I know me too good we're all in the same hunt I like this, but you know I like to speak my mind. No. I am Sophia. Well met. <laughs> and now the wind crystal shall be made whole.
when darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. And I only count three of you. He's good. Better than good. Only Jack can fight like that. Glad to see he's back. <laughs> Took long enough. What? What have I done? And let me forget. Let me forget. Please. Make it stop. supposed to do now? Ash, Jed, Neon, Sophia, what should I do? Astos, help me. They're supposed to change the extraction point every time, you know. But just between us, it's almost always the Chaos Shrine. So it all leads here. Shrine of Chaos. Warning. Chaos infection. Warning. Chaos infection. Extraction denied. Extraction denied. Initiate immediate memory erasure and pacification. Screw you! Warning. Chaos infection. Warning. Chaos infection. Decompression in Station 19. Positive ID. Senior Agent Jack Garland. He's completely corrupted. But this wasn't in Astos' report! He's a traitor. That's why. Contagion confirmed. Report! Unknown. Suspected metaphysical anomaly. Corruption spreading. If this continues, he'll re-establish our link to the old world. Then we have no choice. Reset it. I see no other option. Activating dimensional crystal matrix. Preparing to initiate world reboot. Agent Jack Garland, can you hear me? Clear as day. The station you're in is infected. We're going to reinitialize it along with the old world. We've got no other choice. <laughs> Who do you think you are? He's unintelligible. Likely due to chaos corruption. Jack, acknowledge. Who the fuck do you think you are? Dimensional crystal matrix ready. Standing by. Do it. Activating. Arrogant bastards. Wanna play God? I won't let you. I'll rip that power from your hands and make it my own. What is that? Analyzing. You're wasting your time. This soul is mine to devour. A feast fit for chaos! Now I'll swallow you whole, and even those damn fiends will kneel to me as their lord! I know who you are. I am Darkness Manifest, the sum of the world's fears. You stand before despair given form. You stand before chaos! Shut up. The mantle of chaos is mine! I claim your darkness as my own! Good. Now show me that 
you are worthy. Bear your soul to me. Huh? You asked for it. Just don't flinch from what you see. Jack, let's talk this out. What do you want? It's not enough. It's still not enough. Clearance to isolate and detach Station 19. Control is to be transferred to the next station. Agent Garland, you are hereby discharged. Goodbye, Jack. Lufenia thanks you for your service. You give Central a message of resignation for me. You'll never cast off your shackles to the old world. Not as long as you continue to flush your darkness into Cornelia. So I'll bide my time. Gather my strength, and use that link to return someday. Mark my words, I'll be back to wipe all of you from existence. I'll burn your precious Lufenia to the ground! That is absurd. You saw the power I now wield. Chaos, unpredictable, uncontrollable, while our technology advances by the day. While you're down there, Jack, do remember to keep an eye out for the Warriors of Light. Balance is everything. Champions will arise one day to bring you low. What the hell do you know about Cornelia? Here's a tip. There's no such thing as the Warriors of Light. They're just empty hopes, false dreams, childish fantasy. Oh. <laughs> Who knows more about what makes a warrior of light than us? I get it now. <laughs> hey boss, don't bother sending any more strangers. <laughs> what are you talking about? What's so funny? <laughs> Answer us! Not a chance! set was successful. This was all part of our plan, wasn't it, Ash? Sorry, Jed. It was never a mercy to forget. You were right. And I should have listened. Neon. Sorry to get you mixed up in all of this. Thanks for sticking with us till the end. Sophia, this is our world now. I won't let those bastards use it as their plaything. Those of you who love Cornelia, never give up hope. The warriors of light will come one day.
Welcome home. Hmm. Don't you think it's a little dark in here? We're storing it all here for now. It's still about 2,000 years before the reign of our friend, the King. <laughs> we wove the threads of darkness to pull you back through time. Lufenia's tentacles can't reach us here. <laughs> You're in a good mood. I've got a fun plan. Do tell. We'll train the Warriors of Light ourselves. Interesting. How? The Warriors of Light will be born in Cornelia. Just like you were, Neon. Of course. They're Cornelia's hope, after all. Makes sense they'd be from there. Hope. Despair. Lufenia won't dictate these terms to anyone anymore. I've been wondering, when did you all start scheming to turn me into chaos? He's good. Better than good. Only Jack can fight like that. Glad to see he's back. <laughs> Took long enough. What? Our memories are fragmented and complete, but then we started putting all the pieces together. It was touch and go there for a while. We'd have never figured it out without those hints Astos gave us. Well, there were some unplanned sacrifices. And yet we pulled it off. Kudos to the brilliant mastermind behind it all. Mastermind? Astos, I want you to be my accomplice. With your help, we may be able to change things next time. Be safe, Jack. May the Crystal's blessing be with you, always. Sarah, I... I'd like you to have this. But... This is very special to you. You've never even let me touch it before. A friend gave me some advice once. He said, you've got to be crazy if you want to change the world. And is that what this is? Crazy? Perhaps, but it's only the beginning. Then what happens next? Hmm, let's see. How about I spirit you away to my dark castle? <laughs> Father will send his armies. Oh, I won't stand a chance. But the Lord of Chaos might. Maybe I should change jobs. Then the Warriors of Light will come. <laughs> They're welcome too. <laughs> <laughs>